find sin 1200 to find this we should follow this method c here we have 1200 now you should check 1200 lies between which two multiples of 180 what i mean is 1200 lies between 1080 and 1260 this is 180 into 6 and this is 180 into 7 between these two numbers 1200 lies next now this number is close to which number this is close to 1260 so 1200 now should be written as 1260 minus 60 so this will become sine in place of this we should write this one 1260 minus 60 this is your step one next sine in place of 1260 now we should write 7 into 180 minus 60 next here we have 180 so sign is not going to change it will remain sign and inside we get this angle 60 now the question is will we get here plus or minus to answer that we should look at the number before 180 that is 7 and 7 is odd and all the odd multiples of 180 they lie in either in the second or in the third quadrant so now to select the quadrant we should look at this symbol here we have negative that means angle lies in the second quadrant and in the second quadrant sign is positive so we should put plus so plus sin 60 is root 3 by 2. This is our answer.